You are listening to Catholic Family Podcast. This is William Davis from St. Joseph Minor Seminary back with some more Catholic trivia. This trivia is going to be a hard one, and some of these questions may stump you. If you can answer even 15 out of 25 correctly, give yourself a good a gold star and a pat on the back. And so, on to the questions. When did Our Lady appear to St. Bernadette in Lourdes, France? The answer is February 11th, 1858. Number two. What year was the Council of Nicaea held? Hint, this is during the reign of Constantine the Great. And the answer is 325. Number three. In what country is St. Peter's Basilica located? Don't overthink this one. The answer is Vatican City, not Italy. Number four. Who was the Byzantine emperor who almost reclaimed all of the ancient Roman lands in the 500s? One of the more famous Byzantine emperors in its history. The answer is the Emperor Justinian. Who was Justinian's most successful general? Arguably one of the most successful generals in history. And this is a hard one. The answer is Belisarius. One of the most famous generals, but one of the least known generals in history. Number six. What famous leader, or should I say infamous leader, was given the nickname the Scourge of God? The answer is Attila the Hun. Number seven, and this is another hard one, what famous pope saved Rome from Attila the Hun? And the answer is Pope St. Leo the Great. Number eight, and this is an extra hard question. Where was the seat of Charlemagne and many other Frankish kings set up? And the answer is Aachen, Germany. And sorry to any Germans that if I just brutalized this pronunciation. Number nine. What is the name of the two main religious factions within Islam? The answer is the Sunnis and the Shiites. Number 10. Who was the first American archbishop? And this could be a tough one. But the answer is John Carroll. Number 11. What was the name of the hill on which Our Lady of Guadalupe appeared to Juan Diego, formerly an Aztec temple? And the answer is Tepeyac Hill. Number 12. What was the name of the famous basilica in Constantinople, built by Justinian? And this is a hard one. And the answer is the Hagia Sophia, which in English translates to Holy Wisdom. Number 13. Name the three Fatima children. The three Fatima children were Jacinta, Lucia, and Francisco. And the second part to this question, were they all siblings? The answer is no, they were not. Number 14. Who was the Pope who came after Pope St. Pius X? This is the Pope who reigned during World War I. And the answer is Pope Benedict the Fifteenth. And a bonus, can you guess his secular name? And if you can, this is immediately the gold star to you. And the answer is Giacomo Paolo Giovanni Battista della Chiesa, which I know you're thinking is a mouthful. But that was a hard one. Number 15. What is the primary church in Rome? The seat of the Pope. And the answer is 
St. John Lateran's, not St. Peter's Basilica. Number 16, and this is a hard one. Who was the bishop to whom Juan Diego presented himself on behalf of Our Lady of Guadalupe? And the answer is Bishop Zumarraga. Number 17. Who was the Muslim general and sultan who conquered Jerusalem in 1187? And the answer is Saladin. Number 18. What pope, other than St. Peter, reigned the longest as vicar of Christ? And the answer is Pope Pius IX, who reigned from 1846 to 1878, a total of 32 years as Pope. Number 19. The Great Western Schism ended when which Pope came to the throne? And the answer is Pope Martin V. Number 20. What religious order is known as the Lord's Hounds? The answer is the Dominican Order. Number 21. Who was Pope when the American Civil War broke out in 1871? And if you're paying close attention, you can guess by the name I gave from number 17. And the answer is Pope Pius IX. Number 22. King Philip IV, the Fair, was the king of what country? And the answer is France. Number 23. The Lollards were followers of what English heretic? The answer, John Wycliffe. Number 24. Thomas Jefferson bought the Louisiana Purchase from what French monarch? And the answer is Napoleon Bonaparte. And last but not least, number 25. How old was Pius XII when he died? And this is a tough one. But the answer is he was 82 years old when he died in, in 1958. How did you do? Did you get 15 out of 25? 10 out of 25? I hope you did well. And if you did, congratulate yourself that you know so much about Catholic history and trivia, although there were a couple of secular questions in there. And if you didn't do so well, maybe this should be some incentive to try to study to learn more of your Catholic history. God bless you and goodbye.